What is up YouTube? I am Eric and you are watching Retro Video Game Pickups and in this video we are going to talk about the My Arcade Pac-Man Pocket Player. So if you like games, consoles, or product reviews, please consider subscribing and hitting that bell notification. With that being said, let's hop into it. Okay, so I have the My Arcade Pac-Man Pocket Player in front of me. I've got my trusty pocket knife, and we're gonna go ahead and open this bad boy up and show you guys what this is all about. As you can tell, it is a little handheld Pac-Man player, and I am so stoked to have this, and hopefully this thing works great, because I am really looking forward to it. Now, it says on the front that three games are included, which is Pac-Man, Pan Pac Panic, and Pac-Mania. So with that, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what it looks like. It looks pretty cool. It's like your your retro look up here, and then it has the console itself, uh, and there's kind of a magnet to keep it keep it closed. You guys can probably hear the clicking. On one side it says Pac-Man. On the other side it says Pocket Player, and on the back it shows the console yet again. So. I'm just gonna use my knife, which I think I may have, nope, never mind. I was gonna say, I think I might have fixed it, but uh, it was having problems. So let's go ahead and open this bad boy up and open it, it up and see what it looks like. Cause I'm hoping that this thing isn't garbage because it looks really cool, but things like this kind of somewhat tend to be garbage at times, so, whoa. Okay, so I took everything out, and I'm going to leave that there. First off, it has the Pac-Man Pocket Player Guide, User Guide, it shows you what to do, it shows you how to remove the batteries, uh, and we'll get to that in a second. Basically, it just shows you how to use the thing. Nothing too fancy. I'm gonna go ahead and put that back in. I'm going to stand this up here. I'm gonna go grab batteries, and then I will be back. Whoa, that was really quick. And I found batteries! Okay, so with that being said, I've got the batteries here, and I wasn't sure which ones it took, so I'm gonna go ahead, stack those up there, and unbox this thing, because I'm excited. Go ahead and take this out and hide it behind there. Oh, it looks like I need more batteries. It looks like it takes four AAA batteries and I only grabbed two, so gotta go get more batteries and take these back. I'm back with more batteries! Look how fast that was. I got four batteries and it was really quick. So what I'm gonna go ahead and do is take these batteries, put them in the back here, and then we will get into it. So here is the console itself. It's pretty uh, simplistic the way it looks. Looks like you have the D-pad, the reset and the start button, your A and B buttons, and then you have what looks to be a volume control on the top, a power supply so you could use a micro USB, and then the on and off switch. And as you can tell, it looks like it's got a, a cover on the screen, so I'm gonna go ahead and peel that bad boy off if I can. Wow, that was actually harder to peel it off than I thought it was going to be. Okay, so I have the batteries put into this bad boy, and we're gonna clean off the screen because I was touching it, and go ahead and turn it on, and it automatically boots up. And then it's telling me what game I wanna pick, whether or not I wanna pick Pac-Man, Pac-Mania, or Pac-Panic. So I'm gonna go ahead and insert like six credits and play it. And honestly, this thing isn't that bad. Like, I wish the D-pad was better. But you don't really need the buttons 
Obviously, if you've played Pac-Man, you know how you do it. So, I'm just kind of chilling with it right now. But I am having fun with it. And actually, it looks really good. Uh, like I said, the D-pad's a little eh. I could have problems with it. I could see having problems with it, I guess I should say. And so, that is what I think about this. But overall, this is a fun little console. It looks really good, and so I'm pretty happy about it. Okay, so I played this thing for a little bit, and I had a bunch of fun with it. It looks really good, actually. You really don't have a need for these buttons other to, than to select things. Um, but I'll definitely be using this thing to play Pac-Man. Probably take this wherever I go and have a bunch of fun with it. I just want to say thank you all for watching. Don't forget about Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Big Cartel, Patreon. All that stuff is down below in the description. Check that stuff out if you are interested in it at all. Also, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell notification because it lets you guys know when I put up videos and live stream. So, with that being said, thank you all for watching and make sure you have a good day.